back to the channel, boy. If you're new to the channel, my name is Waihan. I am a freshman in Monash University, Malaysia, taking a computer science degree. And if you know me and if you watch the videos for quite a while, you kind of know that my sleep schedule is kind of... But yeah, since I have so much work to do, not because of procrastination, not this time, literally I have work to do, and also because I kind of want to fix my sleep schedule because now uh, the SEM break is over and I have morning tutorials at like freaking 8am, what the hell? I decided, why not I uh, just stay up the entire night <laughs> and then uh, just go to sleep early the next day and then wake up early. You know, it's kind of like resetting my body clock. This idea, by the way, was sponsored by my friend. His name is Leo. Uh, Leo, I still kind of hate you because you gave me this idea. And I feel bad if I don't do it because it's pretty good content. But at the same time, I know I'm going to torture myself and I'm going to be grumpy as f the entire day tomorrow. Technically today because it's already 1am. So yeah, if you can see here, this is all the work that I need to do this week. Like all the videos and whatnot. And I'm already done with my data science content. Whoa, amazing. Why hunts ahead of schedule? Actually no, it's because I need to like do the assignments that are due in the next two weeks. So yeah, I yeah, technically I'm still ahead of schedule. So yeah, I just got done watching a Python uh, lecture. So now I'm going to take a fast break and make my breakfast for tomorrow. Get it? Fast break, break, fast breakfast. Uh. <sighs> okay, never mind. To be honest, I am actually pretty hungry. Ah. Uh, I might make some Maggie. The thing is, uh, I posted this story that day on my Instagram and I have a friend, okay, her name is Alisa, and she replied to the story saying like, oh, how often do you eat Maggie, dude? Which is kind of true. So, uh, every time I want to make Maggie now, I think of that statement and it guilt trip me, seriously. So, I, I can never make Maggie in peace now. But yeah, today is an exception because I am going to try and stay awake, you know, all this kind of shit. I got my work assignments. I have not finished watching a K-drama which I started. So yeah, I'm gonna go make my breakfast now. If you're curious, let me show you. You're gonna see this cool transition that I learned. Okay, ready? Watch. One, two, three. Whoa, so cool. We're in the kitchen now. I actually have to conserve my energy and not use it all in the vlog. Although I'm pretty hyped right now for some reason. <laughs> okay, so basically what I eat for my first meal of the day after I wake up, uh, it's technically not breakfast. I would call it lunch because I usually wake up at 12. So, and when that happens, I only get like two meals a day, lunch and dinner. And preferably, I'd rather have five meals. So, but yeah, basically it's overnight oats, okay? So if you don't know how overnight oats work, it's literally what the name says. I put seven tablespoons of rolled oats into this uh, container thing and then I add a few scoops of uh, Greek yogurt. It's Greek because I'm just racist like that. I prefer Greek yogurt instead of normal yogurt. And then I add like the ratio is kind of like one to two of milk into the container. So what happens is the oats will like basically absorb the milk and whatnot and become soft and edible and digestible. I don't know how the science works. I'm a computer science student, bro. And then I make some coffee and leave it in the fridge so that I can drink it the morning after the next day. I don't know why I said the morning after. Something's wrong with my brain already, as you can see. So I'm actually feeling a bit sleepy right now. But like, you get the idea, right? If I go to sleep now, then I'll basically wake up like super late at 12 p.m. again. So I need to like force myself to stay awake. And I kind of have a plan for that. But I'll tell you guys about that in a little bit. I, I have to watch the math lecture now. So I'll go watch that and then I'll tell you guys my plan after this. So uh, time lapse, right? I guess. <laughs> Actually, I'm just gonna show you guys something which I find really funny. Just look at all these CSGO players. Ew! Ew! What the fu Hello! So I just got done with the math lecture. Honestly, low-key pretty easy. Actually, it's not even low-key at Fight. this point. I'm quite 
confident that it's pretty easy because this is essentially materials that I have learned in Athmats from 4 which is about 3 years ago I think. Anyhow, as I was saying, my plan was basically I'm going to breeze through all the remaining lectures that I have to watch which is basically one more 2 hour lecture for another unit. I want to do all the work that consumes a lot of my brain power first if that makes sense and then I'll do the more relaxing stuff after that like maybe coding or maths later in the day when I'm like getting sleepier and whatnot. I have yet to fold my clothes, I haven't tidied my room and all those kind of miscellaneous house chores. So I can do that instead of studying when I'm tired later in the day. So right now, I am really 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 hungry so I'm gonna make my Maggie and then I'll probably uh, watch the lecture while enjoying my late night sopa. So I've got my Maggie with uh, egg and some sausages slices cooked here. I also made myself some coffee because I'm feeling kind of tired right now and I don't want to fall asleep. So yeah, I'm gonna start with the lecture and type my notes here. So I'm gonna be like eating while typing which is gonna suck. I'm not gonna film too much of it or time lapse is gonna get quite boring so yeah. See you guys later. Hello. It is currently 4.35 and I feel like my eyes are carrying, I'm sorry, not carrying, lifting weights. They are like literally automatically closing. Like, you know those automatic doors in the malls? Literally, oh my god. But yeah, I'm only five hours into the day and I am about to collapse. I don't know how I'm gonna keep this up. This is a bad mistake. I should have just tried to like gradually sleep early. But no, I have work to do. I need to. I have coffee, I have coffee. It's okay, we got this. Oh, is that Taylor's? Yeah, I don't have a Monash cup yet. Uh, so yeah, Monash University. Hello, welcome back. It is currently 5.30 in the morning. I have half an hour of the lecture to go and I am getting pretty tired, obviously. But I reckon I'll feel much better after taking a cold shower to wake myself up. And then after that, I will probably get working on a math homework, which is due on tonight. <laughs> Hopefully my brain can still think. But yeah, most of the like hard, what, how do you call it? The work that consumes a lot of my brain power, I'm almost done with most of it, including the math one after this. So. I don't really know what I'm talking about right now, but I'm trying to complete all the work which requires high level thinking skills so that I can just proceed the day with like pretty chill stuff so that I basically I won't be spending too much effort trying to like think and all so I can spend the effort trying to stay awake instead. Hello, I just took a bath. I feel much more refreshed and awake. So uh, right now I'm gonna get cracking on the math work that I have which is due tonight before I forget to do it and fall asleep until the next day. It's currently 7am, I am still kinda full from the Maggie that I ate last night. So I don't know when I'm gonna eat breakfast really, so yeah. My mom came down and she was like, You're awake? Hello! I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but it is currently 5.30 in the morning and I've never felt so awake before. I had an amazing sleep last night. I'm actually awake at 5.30 in the morning. Can you believe it? I'm awake before the birds are chirping. I am in very, very unprecedented times, honestly. So basically how I went uh, about yesterday was in the morning, I took about an hour to complete my math assignment and I, I handed it in after. And then I had my breakfast. I attended a math tutorial after that from 9.30 to 11 in the morning which was honestly the most boring tutorial ever. I was so tired and so sleepy. I kept falling asleep. And then I uh, just had lunch and I continued studying for a bit and then I chilled 
and played some Dota and watched some YouTube because I got really tired. Like my mental energy, I just couldn't think anymore. Like it was just gone. I was physically there, but mentally lost. But I got a ton of work done yesterday, especially before I was mentally gone. So I got all the heavy duty work done in the morning, like, you know, all the lectures and whatnot. So right now I am currently just left with three homeworks, uh, two computer science related stuff and one math homework. And then I have the two assignments, but those are like due next week and next next week. So I can complete the homework for this week and then focus on the assignments without any other like distractions other than editing this video. But yeah, I feel absolutely amazing right now. Huge improvement. Hopefully I keep this up. Uh, thank you very much, Leo, for this suggestion. Although it was torturous, absolutely torturous trying to stay up for 36 hours straight. So yeah, I uh, hope you like this video. Please do not try this at home unless you really, really want to. I drank like three cups of caffeine to stay awake yesterday, which is not really healthy, but you gotta do what you gotta do, right? So yeah, I hope you like this video. Subscribe if you want to, and I'll catch you guys the next time. Ciao. It's my niche, play my role, what you hold, little boy, best on reach. Yo shit dirt, you get curved, I just saw and reap. With that ease, hella clean, rips all on your knees. That's that work when you hurt, my head full of steam. I got lucid dreams, I make movie scenes. This not new to me, Greek gon' kill I scream. Ego my enemy, my heat got entropy, it's all just chemistry.